The College of William and Mary welcomes a new face. Former FBI Director James Comey is now Professor James Comey. But he won't be in Williamsburg. Comey will teach at the school's Washington, D.C. campus. The hire comes after much controversy last year surrounding Comey and President Trump. The president removed Comey from his post as the head of the FBI. It's a move that's now under strict scrutiny by special counsel Robert Mueller. Nico Clemens explains how that experience translates into the classroom. Former FBI Director James Comey back in the headlines. And this feels like a very successful moment for us. Comey joining the College of William and Mary to teach a course on ethical leadership. He's co-teaching with another William and Mary professor, Drew Stelges. Executive Director of the William and Mary Washington Center, Adam Anthony, credits Comey's leadership experience. Our students are just going to be able to sit and listen to him and engage with him on, on the topics. Um, have his real world experience come in. The news comes months after President Trump fired Comey. The president fired Comey days after he testified on Capitol Hill about the FBI's investigation into Russia's election meddling and the possible connections between Russia and the Trump campaign. We thought about the whole, everything that was going on with him, and we realized that he's somebody that we admire and respect and felt like he would be an incredible um, resource for our students. The news on campus getting mixed reaction. Whereas some people might be able to teach it from a theoretical standpoint, like he's actually lived it, and so he's going to bring a unique perspective that way. It's a very controversial move because obviously there are people on both sides of that who believe that it was ethical for Trump to fire Comey, and others who believe that it was unethical. And Comey will teach the fall, spring, and summer semesters at the William & Mary Washington Center in Washington, D.C. Now, the class, they plan to meet at the William & Mary School of Education at least once, where they'll live stream that class to the students back